Mark for here here. This time, not a video on retro games or retro computers. No, this time it's again a trip to our garden, our backyard. Having arrived to the back door, it's uh, it's a bit wet. Our little beans are being chewed on by birds. No, but the reason for me to walk outside and get my feet wet is actually that there's free bovines. There's free freaking bovines. We got a new fence at the back of our property. starting to peek through the uh, the soil but yeah I love myself some more vines let that be noted for the rest our garden needs some maintenance <laughs> we have potatoes growing just about everywhere <laughs> we got rid of one of our raised beds and there were some potatoes in there, very small ones we didn't see. And they start to grow, they start to bloom, which is nice. You can never have too few potatoes, or too many, it says, oh, whatever. Anyways, some road potatoes over here, fennel, leek, and raspberry, and onion, and this, this side of our roof, our sedum roof is a bit suffering. I guess it dries out a bit too much being in the east part of the roof. And that vine, I really need to get that into in control, but I love these wildflowers and there's a lot of berries, blueberries growing, but we need to get rid of those vines. That's not our cat. I heard it already have a lot of cats. We don't have a cat ourselves and and uh, they usually do timeshare in gardens that don't have a cat. Oh, and we have some brambles over here as well. Brambles combined with roses. Yeah, I mean they're both from the Rosacea family but yeah somehow we have a combined plant. Some lettuce that seems to be in camouflage but and it's grown so large, it's, it's really, uh, perhaps start to, to grow bitter. And then our strawberries, there, there's big ones, but they're all green. I want red one. Oh, is there a red one? Ooh. Yeah, it's not entirely red, but... What do you want to eat? Mm. Yeah, lovely. Anyways, um, yeah. Oh, and the sedum blooming. It's like an alien world. Oh, and the hedge is really <laughs> sprouting out some. Uh, some growth. We need to uh, keep it under control. And this tree sadly has died. It's not uh, an old tree. It still has its uh, supportive uh, bands and pole, but we'll take it out. And I believe we can actually witness uh, the arrival flight of the Chinook helicopter. They're always practicing. And there's a base and we live in a, an area that is actually has a lot of rivers and there's a lot of uh, uh, well practice runs, safety runs and stuff to, to handle and take care of. But, mm, I think it's too cloudy. You won't be able to see. So, some bovines to finish off the video. Oh, look, some blackbird, not blackbirds, some, some crows. Mm. The helicopter.
Jasper sounds really close. Signing off and I'll be back with